A glass media vessel is a great product if you've got quite a dirty with water with a high turbidity and you need to filter it as well it'll dramatically extend the life of any filters after it and it's washable so typically you would take it with an automatic backwash head which you'd simply set to the frequency that um, it needs to do the backwash to clean itself important with these heads is that you use a cover with them if they're at all outdoors or in a place where um, rain might get to it as they're not waterproof a glass media vessel lasts a long time you typically would get 10 to 15 years lifespan out of a media unless it gets too dirty then it can be a problem one of the nice things with these vessels is you actually the dirtier they are the finer they filter so we'd normally recommend getting them with at least two pressure gauges or with two pressure gauges and a flow meter as what this allows you to do is say for example set set the unit to run at a specific um, flow rate say a thousand liters an hour and then look at what the pressure drop across the unit is when it's clean then as it um, as you leave it to run you'll see if you set it to the same flow rate your pressure drop across the unit will start to increase and this will give you a good indication of when it's time to actually run the backwash cycle so initially this will take a bit of playing around with to try and figure out what is the optimal thing for uh, optimum time for your unit but once you've got that set up it's typically not something that needs to change often and the setup here allows you to troubleshoot it quite quite easily if something goes wrong say the valve it gets hit by lightning or so in um, this configuration we have got a way to isolate the vessel and run a bypass just into the other filters if needed if for example you need to send the valve in for repairs but yeah overall a great way to save money on filters and a really nice way to handle uh, much more dirty water